wasi 2020 further mathematics question 4 express 1 over x squared minus 16 in partial fractions we know 1 over x squared minus 16 is the same as 1 over x minus 4 times x plus 4 when we use difference of two squares you know x squared minus 16 is the same as x squared minus 4 squared and that will give us this factorization so factor this to get this now we let this be identical to a over x minus 4 plus b over x plus 4 so if that is the case then we can collect LCM on the right hand side so when you find the LCM we have x minus 4 x plus 4 then this comes here we are left with a times x plus 4 this one also comes here we are left with x minus 4 times b so we can say that the denominators are now equal so the numerators must also be equal if that is the case we can expand on the right hand side to get 1 is equal to ax plus 4a plus bx minus 4b we can group regroup the terms and compare co compare coefficients so regroup the x terms and the y and the constant terms so for the constants compare coefficient of constant on both sides we have 4a minus 4b is equal to 1 this will give us our first equation the comparing coefficient of x we have a plus b is equal to 0 which means that a is equal to negative of b and that will give us our second equation now the next thing we do is to solve this equation simultaneously so let's put equation 2 in equation 1 to get this so we can simplify to get negative 8b equal 1 which means that b is equal to negative 1 over 8 then we substitute into the second equation to get a to be 1 over 8 so it means that our partial fraction is actually this we substitute a and b into the expression here and this is the same as 1 over 8 into x minus 4 minus 1 over 8 into x plus 4 now if you want to use another approach let's say cover up rule after reaching this point after reaching this point then after reaching here we Put, we plug in the zeros of the factors plug, plug in the zeros of these terms so consider this term when x equal 4 when x equal 4 we want to eliminate the b then we get this substitution and we will see that the b term will go away because we get 0 here and when we solve for a we get a equal 1 over 8 then when we want to eliminate the a we substitute x equal negative 4 when x equal negative 4 we get the a to be 0 having a coefficient of 0 which means that 1 equal negative 8b hence our b equal negative 8 so we continue as usual to obtain our partial fraction as this so if you like this video click the like button share with your colleagues also comment now if you can still see this writing here it means you have not yet subscribed 
so you just have to click it so that the next upload you see it is still red you have to click it so that if i upload the next video you'll be informed click the bell icon too so that you get a notification whenever i upload a new video thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe